Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have Gregory here with me and we're gonna be answering the big question that everyone is always asking. <laughs> Why you touch me? You touch me, it's my chest. Today we're gonna be answering the question. Oh my god, this family. Today we're gonna to be answering the question of why we're not married. I guess people assume that we are because we've been together for so long and we're not. And that's Zara. I'm, I can't keep starting on her. So Zara's here, Zoe's here, and we're trying to keep them quiet, but they're gonna obviously make noise. So we're just gonna answer that question. Um, and yeah, so if you guys wanna see this video, just keep watching and don't forget to click down below and subscribe. Gotta subscribe for that one. <laughs> Don't forget to click down below and subscribe. All right, guys. So the big question: Why we aren't married? We are engaged. We've been engaged for what? I'm gonna go on two years, right? Yep. Yeah. So Zara kind of interrupted the wedding because we got pregnant with Zara. But before then, um, we weren't. Before we got engaged, obviously we weren't engaged, but we were just like what they call boyfriend girlfriend. But to us, we feel like we're married. Texas, we call it coming along. So. So that's what we call it in this house. I'm saying us, not like everybody else. Sure. Okay. Anyways, so to us, it's like we're kind of married because we've been together for so long. Um, but we was engaged before. Mm -hmm. right we wasn't. So we was engaged before, but that didn't work out i felt like that i wasn't ready to get married so i called off the whole wedding situation the first time um and when he proposed to me the first time i was actually pregnant with zoe and before i got pregnant with zoe we were looking at rings um bef before i even knew i was pregnant and then he proposed <laughs> how did you propose Greg? He, I was like laying in bed and I think we were mad at each other mm -hmm. and he just got down and just proposed and I was like in the room and I was like, yeah, I guess, but I truly, I just wasn't ready. Greg said he was, but I don't think he was. And I honestly feel like if we would've got married then we probably wouldn't be together now. Do you feel that way? I mean, we were young and it felt kind of like it was forced a little bit. So yeah. Yeah. it wasn't as genuine as it, it is, is now, now. yeah <laughs> look at that oh my god it is now yeah so that's how i truly felt i guess the the answer of why we haven't gotten married or like what took so long even for another engagement it was just um a lot of issues in our relationship that we had to work on together and <laughs> There was issues with me, like personal, and there was issues with Greg personal, and like we had to work on each other, and then we had to come together and work on each other as a couple. And <laughs> what are you talking about? This is before your time, girl. And I just felt like if you can't work on yourself separately and then come together and work on each other, Sarah, gosh, why she do this when I'm recording? Oh then it's no point of even trying to be in a relationship and i think the main thing was just um the immaturity like we was just not mature we weren't mature um there was a lot of mistakes made on my part and there was some mis i mean some mistakes made on greg's part and i just honestly feel like if you're with someone right now and you're waiting for that person to propose um i would just take a step back and say maybe there's a reason why they haven't proposed to you maybe they're just waiting for them to kind of finish fixing themselves before they kind of like create this this what do you call it like relationship with you on a different level so that could be another thing or if y'all are engaged you've been engaged for so long and they just haven't made time to even sit down with you to plan a wedding then maybe you need to rethink some other things but i know for us um it took us what zoe six now it took us like four and a half years after zoe four and a half years to actually like get right like get right we yeah we had to work on you know being better communicators yeah that was um, like the number one thing you know not holding stuff in Dang. that's a build up until you know it yeah. was an end and yeah. then we just attack each other arguments and stuff so i mean you know every relationship still has arguments and all that but it was a lot worse than what it yeah. used to be now we're able to really come together and you know except when it comes down to food i don't know what i mean 
She still can't make decisions when it comes to food. But Whatever. Other than that, um, you gotta ask. So. Yeah, it, it was like the communication was really bad between us, and I think that was the main thing. That was the main thing that was really like holding us back was the communication and then also just resentment on certain things that probably happened in the past and like we were both holding on to. We just couldn't let it go. Um, we just had to like sit down and just be like, if this is what we want, this is what we need to do. We don't even argue like that. Like we may say, oh, da, 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 and then like 10 minutes later, yay, let's go do it. Like it's like nothing ever happened. And it's not like, oh, we just dusted on the rug. Like we used to just like be mad and I'll stay mad for days and then I'll kind of just dust it on the rug and then communicate with, you know, just talk to him. And then when something happened, I will bring that back up. But now like that don't even happen at all. Like we don't even argue like at all like i can't remember the last time we had like a real explosive argument to where either i slept on the couch or you slept on the couch and that was the thing like one of us would like sleep on the couch no or, like, no, no, sleep. no no i wouldn't sleep on the couch <laughs> i would sleep on the couch <laughs> because i wouldn't want to stay in the same room as him because i was that upset um i wouldn't cook for him i wouldn't do nothing like i wouldn't even talk to him like that hasn't happened like in maybe like what three years two mm -hmm. years like but even like after, I thought like once we had Zoe, like things would change when we were younger, but it didn't. Like it kind of, it didn't make it worse. It just wasn't changing. And it was really stressful because we had a new baby. And then, you know, we we're both still in school. And I thought things would change. Yeah. But it didn't. And um, obviously, we feel comfortable enough to talk about this in front of our children because. We obviously want them to know that like we love each other just as much as we love them and we always want them to see that we have a be the best relationship because of them and for them. But also yeah. another reason why is because before I didn't mind doing the um, courthouse wedding. She was very adamant on this... no courthouse wedding. No. And now things have flipped to where she wants to do the courthouse I'm like, no, I want the big wedding, so that's kind of... Yeah, I at first, I wanted to have this big, lavish wedding and all this stuff, and I had planned my wedding out and everything, and then things changed, like, just, you just get older and you just get wiser and just a lot of stuff happen, um, and you start to decide that you don't want this big wedding anymore. I kind of want to save more money, and I, and I just want to kind of get it over with, because I feel like I don't want to be engaged for, like, four years, so I know... We're going to get married soon. Um, we don't know exactly what date yet. We're planning other stuff first and then um, we're going to plan the wedding. So we are going to get married soon. It's not going to be like maybe in a few months, but it's going to happen fairly soon. Um, another thing is the reason why we haven't got married yet is just like when we get when you get married, your stuff becomes one like my credit like my like bills and his bills or things that's on my credit and his credit and stuff and because we're trying to make certain things happen we felt like it was smart enough for us to kind of like not be married to do that we just thought like to keep everything separate it'll be easier for us to get those things done quicker than versus us getting married so it's just a those kind of things but honestly the main thing was just us not being one versus how we are now like it's not even a show for the video or for youtube or for instagram or nothing like that like we don't even post a whole bunch of couple photos because like i mean that stuff don't really matter to us because we know how we feel about each other i don't need to always say oh my man does this and this because i know what greg does on a daily basis um and he knows what i do on a daily basis so it's not we don't need to always have to brag about our relationship and we really, really do care about each other we love each other like to the point where obviously i had another kid by him <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Look at Zara. I don't know. She don't really look like me, though. I'm just. Anyways, uh, that one looks like you <laughs> over there. That one looks just like you. Um. So yeah, that that was like the reason. My reasonings behind it. I mean, there's a little bit more detail into it, but I just feel like we don't really have to really get that far into that. But it was just a question that people always ask, and people just assume that we're married because I guess we've been together. It's about to be what ten years. Oh my god, that's a long time. That's a long time. Cause Zoe's six. Yeah, we've been together for a long time, Greg. 
that's crazy so yeah we've been together for so long and people always ask like, why you guys aren't married or oh i thought you guys were married and i'm just like no in school everybody in class just assumed that we were married because we were together and we had zoe and i was just like no we're not married like and i mean sometimes when people say oh your husband i'll be like yeah because he is basically and he's going to be oh, so co-worker say wife so yeah yeah it's my parents say you their daughter and yeah so vice versa when it comes to your family so we yeah, might as well be huh you have anything else to say i said do you have anything else to say huh look at the bad boy oh my god <laughs> do you have anything else to say? <laughs> all right guys so basically this whole purpose of this video is if you're in a relationship with someone and you guys are going to get married congratulations or if you're wanting to get married to that person um but you're having a lot of issues with that person and i can think, i can honestly say that your best thing is is to just communicate with them try to have better communication and overall together as one y'all should be now understanding every relationship is different so compare yeah one relationship to another yeah, isn't the same. Right. You know, everybody does things at different points and they relate. Like, sometimes people get married within the first six months to a year. Sometimes people don't at all. Sometimes it just takes a while depending on what's going on in their life and stuff. So it's yeah. understanding your relationship is different than the next person. So Yeah, and everybody is not a Beyonce and Jay Z story. Like, it, you guys, everybody wants that, but even their relationship isn't perfect our relationship isn't perfect at all and we don't want to show that that it is you know any kind of way but it's not um it's just our communication is way better than what it used to be so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope this answers some questions for you guys and gave you a little bit more insight into our little life and if you have any questions or comments um leave them down below don't forget to give don't, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to click and subscribe. And I can't wait to chat with you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. She said bye, too.